We'll simplify this question by first splitting up cubic root of 432. So let's write cubic root of 432, we can write a multiple, which is 216 times 2 minus 5 times cubic root of 2 remains same. Now we'll separate this cubic root between those two. So that's cubic root of 216 times cubic root of 2 minus 5 times cubic root of 2. Now we can write this first part, which is cubic root of 216 as 6, because 216 is a 6 cube, times cubic root of 2 will be same, minus 5 times cubic root of 2. So we see that they both have cubic root of 2, so we can just common out and write this as 6 minus 5 whole times cubic root of 2. So 6 minus 5 is 1 times cubic root of 2 and 1 times cubic root of 2 is nothing but cubic root of 2 so that's our final answer.